Hey, good day! In this video, we're farming the Shattered Necklace, which hands in for a bunch of experience once we hit level 37. How much experience that is depends on your faction. For Horde, the quest is Necklace Recovery, which is in Orkuma, and it will give 3,300 experience. Now, normally with this style of quest, you'd pick up the quest, then you'd get the item, then you'd hand it in. But for this particular one, the item that you hand in can be farmed in advance. And for the Alliance, it's even better. For Alliance, the item starts the quest, which is called the Shattered Necklace, and it awards 3,300 experience in Ironforge, but it's even better. It also then gives an easy follow-up to hand in 5 silver bars for a bonus 2,450 experience with the quest Law for a Price. So we're farming the necklace here in the far north of Badlands, right on the border with Loch Madan. We have two mobs that can drop it, with around a 10 to 15% drop chance. The first and easier mob to kill is the Shadow Forge Digger. What we want to do with these is kite them up into Loch Modan and then run around this tree here. If there is a low level mob nearby, just have your pet kill it. Otherwise it's going to aggro onto us and while it wouldn't really hurt us, it might daze us from our cheetah aspect. And then once we're at the tree, we can just run around in circles around the tree and kill it with Chimera Shot. You can also get a few auto shots in here and there, but I wouldn't be too aggressive with that. You really don't want it to catch you in Daisy. Now we'll speed up the rest of this one, and then let's look at the other sort of mob. Right, the other sort of mob is the Shadow Forge Surveyor. We can't do the same kiting around a tree here, since they have a ranged fireball, but we can outrange that fireball by running around with Cheetah. You'll see here that I initially try and range it with Black Fathom Boon, but no Cheddar Aspect. But when I do this, I get hit by a few fireballs. It is probably doable, with a little bit better timing, but let's just make this easy and use Cheetah for it. I run in, fire a Chimera shot, and then as soon as I see it start casting on me, I'm going to run away and outrange that fireball. Now you'll need a lot of space for this, so what I do is I kite it around the lake and lock my arm. And fortunately for me, none of the Alliance here gave me any grief. Of course, if you're an Alliance yourself, or if you play on a PvE server, this won't be a concern at all. And now I'll just speed up the rest of this mob as well, just so you can see the full kite. A few moments later. Alright, and there's the item. What we do now is just pop it into our bank, and then once we hit level 37, we can hand it in for a bit of extra experience to make our level 25 to level 40 leveling just that little bit faster and smoother in Season of Discovery Phase 2. Thanks for watching. I have many more similar tips and tricks to share, so if that's something that you're interested in, please do subscribe. It helps me a lot. Until next time, bye for now.